morning guys today is Monday morning and I've just gotten ready for work and try and smash out some losing weight um, I've definitely put on some of the weight that I lost back in my last vlog so in my last vlog I think I was 81.9 and I'm pretty sure I'm about 82.5 so I put on a bit like a kilo or something so I definitely need to kind of lose that and lose more and I've just had such a shitty weekend like I ate bad for two days and uh, I just can't have a cheat day. Like I can have a cheat meal and be fine. When I have a cheat day, I have everything. Like yesterday I had Maccas and then for lunch I had like other shit like sushi and stuff and I just need to stop because once I have one bad meal, the day just follows bad. <laughs> so nonetheless, let's start this fresh. Let's just honestly try and just make the end of 2019 somewhat get to that 10k losing weight goal so i think that's like four kilos so at least i can do that and at least i can tick off something from my new year's resolution or new year's thing saying that i lost 10 kilos so that's my goal and let's hope i smash it out and i'm gonna have you guys along every single day and pretty much so today i am not gonna eat anything until maybe about two o'clock because I ate up till nine o'clock last night and I'm gonna get back into IF. Um, so I'm gonna have some apple cider vinegar now and maybe like a pre-workout. And then when I get to work, I'll just like chill and then I'll have my lunch break a little bit later and then I'll have my dinner as normal. Hey guys, sorry, I know I didn't really say this at the start of the video and now I'm popping it in now. But pretty much what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be doing four vlogs. Um, and they're going to be fortnightly episodes. So instead of trying to do my old way of doing like a week of weight loss, I knew that I would be so good certain days and then other days on the weekend, I would kind of fall off the bandwagon and I honestly just maintained it. So what I'm going to try and do is I'm going to try and do four really good episodes because I'd rather have four decent episodes than eight semi like all over the place episodes. And I'll mainly just put in like good bits of the video. So I'm going to be having one up every single fortnight on Sundays. But I'll still be doing a weekly weigh in. And you guys will be seeing that every single kind of Sunday. Um, but so far this week this is kind of what I'm doing. And I feel like it's going to work well. So if you guys are enjoying this video please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Because it supports my channel out a lot. And... I hope I'm inspiring some of you guys, so keep watching and I hope you enjoy the rest. Morning guys, it is Tuesday and it's 9.30 and I'm all ready to go for kind of a half an hour walk. I don't think I'll get more in because I left this so last minute and I have work soon. But I'll talk to you guys when I get back from my walk. I'm back from like my... 35 minute walk and I was gonna go longer but here in Sydney it's already like it's already 24 degrees and I was a bit hot today I am just I'm gonna chill out for like another maybe 10 minutes and then I'm gonna make eggs and bacon for brekkie and then I'll probably start getting ready for work today I have such an easy shift I'm just doing 12 to 6 so uh, like a six hour shift um, but I actually work like 45 minutes away so it's I have to leave here at like 11 um, just because I don't want to pay for parking today and I'll get like a 15 minute walk in walking to work So that will be it all adds up for my steps like that's the way I look at it So I'm best to do that if I can find a park, but yeah, that's kind of my goal at the moment So today I weighed myself and I was 82.5 kilos Keep in mind. I probably have had a few glasses of water. See that's what I need to like obviously keep in mind but it doesn't matter. I'm just going off the measurements now. So I did all my measurements on my parts of my body. So my breast was 95 centimeters. My waist was 90 centimeters. My hips were 106 centimeters. My left upper thigh, so the biggest bit of my thigh was 64 centimeters. And my left upper arm, obviously like the bigger bit was 33 centimeters. I don't know if I want to do my neck. Nah, let's not do my neck because I don't really care about that. But these are my measurements and this is what I'm going to go off. So you'll see some more measurements next Tuesday. But let's go eat some brekkie because I am so hungry. <laughs>
So this will be kind of my afternoon snack or like second meal of the day for work. So I generally mix all that and then just break the banana up in here and I'll have like a little bit of a yogurt fruit salad and this is like my sugar treat. Even though they're not that good but it's something small. So yeah, I'm about to eat my brekkie now. Oh my god, I'm on to my last bite. I am so full. I've like struggled to eat this last bit of bacon. This last night from the supermarket and I'm going to put some in a Ziploc bag to have with my yogurt. I honestly can't see right now like the sun is so blocked out but I'm currently on my Wednesday walk I've been walking for about 17 minutes so yay <laughs> Hey guys, sorry I've been doing such a bad job. This is why I'm doing fortnightly vlogs instead of a week because I feel like I'm just going to miss so many days. But today is Thursday the 1st of November at about 3 o'clock and I've just come home from work, put my pyjamas on. If I'm being honest, I'm not feeling 100% at all. Um, yesterday I had an appointment to get my lip filled. First time ever and I didn't know that you needed to eat like a proper meal so after that I went and got McDonald's because I was like I am so hungry I feel so dizzy I just feel like I need to get carbs in my system um, and then at night I had like a Caesar salad which like yeah so I had that for dinner and then this morning I kind of wanted to get to work early so I was pushing it for time so I didn't have breakfast and then when I was driving to work I just felt so lightheaded I just felt dizzy I just felt like lethargic yeah so then I got to work and I was like you know what I'm just gonna go get a coffee so I went and got a coffee and then I was just so off thank god it was only like a four hour shift today and then I knew it was gonna be like a 45 minute drive and I was like you know what I just don't feel well so I stopped into Macca's I got a cheeseburger meal like the tap coke really like gave me energy and I feel so much better now like as much as it was a cheat meal and I knew I should have been eating bad foods I would have come home and had a salad um I didn't have any chicken cooked or anything and it just wouldn't have been filling for me so I have been kind of off the bandwagon for the past couple days um but I'm just gonna eat super healthy for the rest of the day and I just know that when you feel crap like you just want something like you don't want to always eat healthy so that's what I did um so tomorrow and the weekend let's try and speed up this healthiness hopefully my lethargic feeling goes away and I'll hopefully go on a walk this afternoon. It's currently like 9 a.m. on Friday morning and here I am trying to be, you know, all good and I went for my walk in the morning and to be honest, it was the best thing I did. It's quite cold at the moment, which is good. Normally I go in the afternoon and then in the afternoon it's like so hot and like a mugged. So best choice of the day. Just finished my walk. I only did 38 minutes, but it is so hot and... I just don't want to like make myself hot for the rest of the day so your girl just said that's enough
guys it's Tuesday night and I know that I haven't vlogged for like the past five days but you can probably tell I'm actually really sick and I have been kind of sick for the past week but it's just really gotten worse the past couple of days like I haven't eaten too bad but I've still had a few cheat meals you guys can probably tell when I don't vlog that I probably had something bad I will kind of show you what I'm going to eat tomorrow morning anyway. I thought I would just give you a little quick update. Um, and what I'm going to do is, I know I didn't do like a... Fuck, I'm so out of breath. I know that I didn't do like a weigh-in that week. But what I'll do is, when I started it, I was 82.5. So I'll do a weigh-in at the end of this video. And then you guys will be able to see my weight. And then we'll start the new episode then. But so sorry about like not filming but you guys can tell I am quite sick. I'm very like lightheaded and I just don't feel 100%. So, so hopefully I feel a lot better in the morning. Um, if I get worse, you'll probably guys will just see. But yeah, <laughs> thought I'd just give you guys a little bit of an update. Like, sorry. <laughs> afternoon guys i was gonna say morning today is wednesday about yeah it's 2 15 and i haven't eaten anything all day i've had two liters of water and i'm just starting to feel hungry now um i've had some like meat patties left out so i've had those for a few did you guys just hear that Lol, in my last clip, my dog just ran into our glass door. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so I've had some meat patties left out and I want to make some naked burgers. So I'm going to duck down to the supermarket now, get some like iceberg lettuce. And I think I might get like some throat lozenges for my throat. Um, I definitely feel a little bit better now. Not going to lie, I felt really bad this morning. But I think there's not that much liquid that can come out of my nose anymore but yeah so I'm gonna have those for lunch kind of um, and for dinner I'm not too sure what I make Wednesday I always have to cook dinner so either I might do like a stir fry maybe like I said I haven't really eaten anything all day so I can kind of carve up if I want but yeah I'll talk to you guys when I get back from the grocery store and I'll give you a little bit of a haul I know I'm only gonna duck out for a few things here is my patty We've got some tomatoes and some iceberg lettuce. coming along very nicely so quick and easy guys is I just get like a slice of cheese and I just pop it on the patty and I'm gonna let that kind of melt a little bit and then I'll pop it on my lettuce wraps that cheese melts yep and then we'll pop this on and now I'm gonna coat it with heaps of tomato I'm not too sure if I want to put cucumber on it. Like, what else do they put on burgers? Put my tomato on, and then let's try and wrap this up. I'll do it on camera. Alright, so. Oh my god. This is it. Let's do this. Taking my naked. <laughs> let's do this on camera. That is so nice. Like, you can't even tell that that's semi-healthy. Like, 
it's like a keto burger i would say almost but yeah oh uh, i'm gonna eat this and i'll talk to you guys after i know i look shit today but it's because i'm sick up a nectarine i'm so happy they're in season and i'm gonna have this for a snack good morning guys today is saturday and it's about 11 30 and i'm currently doing myself a fruit salad i think um I was gonna make bacon and eggs, but then I was like, you know what? I have bananas and I rarely have bananas. So let's make a little bit of a fruit salad. So I'll show you guys how it looks when I'm done. This is my basic dinner. <coughs> this is my basic dinner. Does anybody else eat like not much when they're sick? I didn't even have like a proper brekkie food, so that's why I'm probably wanting this. But I'm about to eat this and I'll talk to you guys either later tonight or tomorrow. Good morning guys. Today is Sunday and I'm just getting ready for work. I had yesterday off work because ugh, that was like the worst day I've ever felt in the longest time. Um, so hopefully today's shift goes really fast. I do have a super duper busy day. So I hope I'm not going to make my sickness any worse. But yeah, I'm going to give you guys a little bit of a brief update. So today I weighed myself when I was 81.1. And like I said on Thursday, I did weigh myself when I was 80. Point eight, but I was so sick the day before I probably had one meal so it was pretty like it was pretty obvious that like I wouldn't maintain that but yeah now I'm eating normal like I'm I've had to have a lot of carbs the past couple days because my body's just been so run down and I've just been feeding it want what it wants because the last thing I want when I'm sick is to feel even shitter so I've just been eating what I want but yeah, like I think I'm going to wrap this vlog up now because when I get home from work, I'm going to be so tired anyway. But I just want to say thank, say thank you guys for watching this vlog. Like I said, we're doing this every fortnight or maybe every week, depends how much footage I get. So there'll be an, a new one up in two weeks or next Sunday. I'll just see how I go. But yeah, I'm hoping to kind of shred a few more kilos before Christmas. So that's all from me and I hope you all have a lovely day and yeah, thanks again for watching and don't forget to subscribe if you are new down below. Thank you.